Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo and today we are out and about shopping and it's all about the teachers. We're going to look at lots of different ideas for teachers gifts. Let's go shopping. So we'll start off right here at Target where I have a PSA for you guys. If you are going to give your teacher a ceramic coffee bug, stop in your tracks and think about it. They are in the classroom up to eight, 10 hours a day. They drink more than just coffee. So you may want to consider a insulated cup, a tumbler, something if they're a water drinker, a tea drinker, or a coffee drinker that is a little bit nicer than your average one to $2 ceramic mug. If they've been teaching for any amount of time, they have a cupboard full of them and you may want to think outside the box. Nice insulated tumblers can be pricey, but Target has a beautiful collection of all these bright colors and all different styles for $8.99. I think a sipper like this would be perfect, something for a man or woman. And if you want to do a little added something, you can pick up one of these crystal lights these are perfect for just flavoring your water, giving you something a little bit different to drink and just pop one of those right inside, put a bow on top and you're done. Having been a room mom many times, I know that sometimes we like to all chip in and do something a little bit nicer for our teacher for the holidays. If that is the plan, you may want to consider one of these single serve Keurigs. They are perfect because they don't take up a whole lot of room in the classroom and yet they function very well and will save your teacher time running to and from the break room. Now, if a Keurig is not in the budget, don't worry about it. There are lots of other affordable options on the market and you can always find sales around the holidays. There are plenty of smaller compact coffee makers on the market that all run about $20. Now, if you're a practical gift giver like me, you're going to think of things that your teacher is always looking for. Scissors are probably right at the top of the list, and I think they make a great gift, especially if you invest in a nice pair. Something else that may be a great gift, not only for your teacher, but your classroom would be a nice new pencil sharpener. I know that they are hard to keep alive, but they are always appreciated. I think another great gift for teachers is staplers. They are used daily from putting things up on the bulletin board to stapling packets together. And just because it's a nice stapler doesn't mean it's gonna cost an arm and a leg. You can find really nice ones for under $10. If you're looking for something smaller, you may wanna consider a little bundle of binder clips or magnets, things that they will surely use every day. If your teacher really likes to stay organized, you may want to consider a label maker. They come in all different sizes and price ranges and will definitely help labeling everything at the beginning and end of the year. I know that tape dispensers are very affordable and something that always are appreciated in a classroom, especially if you can group them with a whole pack of tape. This next gift is one of my favorites and something that we did for our teachers one year that got excellent reviews. They were so thankful. Think about it. Teachers are in the classroom all day. And many times when the students are out to lunch, teachers are still in the classroom, either grading papers, working with a student who needs a little extra help and trying to eat their lunch all at once. So if you can pick up a really nice lunch box that reminds you of your teacher, maybe in school colors or something neutral, and fill it full of things that they can eat throughout the day. Head to some place like Trader Joe's or the grocery store where you can pick out some really healthy options, things that don't need to be refrigerated that can stay in their lunch bag in the classroom in case they forget their lunch. From nuts and trail mix to dried fruits, Things like little cups of fruit or applesauce. Other great options would be individual oatmeal and soup, things that you can just add hot water to and have a meal on the go. Now PSA number two, if you want to bring your teacher a treat for the holidays, skip baking and head to the store for something that is pre 
packaged. That's right, I am condoning buying something over baking. My mom was a teacher and I remember what a nightmare it was to try and bring home all kinds of baked goods in the car. The prepackaged items came home neatly and we could open them up at our leisure, not worrying about them going bad or getting stale. Now onto the Dollar Tree. So I've never met a teacher that didn't love the Dollar Tree and I feel like there's a lot of options here for teacher's gifts. The thing I would suggest is maybe grab a container, grab a few things, put them all together and make one big gift. You can get some glue sticks, all kinds of binder clips, push pins, paper clips. I know staple removers are very popular. You can get them in a two pack. And then I know that a lot of teachers like to put things together with rubber bands. We have the large binder clips that you're not going to find cheaper anywhere else in a pack here of eight. And dry erasers. They go through dry erase markers and these erasers quite quickly. I will also show you guys how you could use something like this for a teacher's gift, but definitely want to look for anything that is magnets or magnetic clips. They use those quite a lot and you can always use a hole punch. Definitely look at getting some sticky notes and or a notepad. Those are things teachers use on the daily and especially these smaller flag style if you can find them. I know a lot of teachers use them to flag certain pages for their students. The Dollar Tree also carries staplers. I would avoid this kind. It'll probably get ruined really quickly. I'd go with something a little higher quality. But if you're putting a gift together for your teacher, you can always pick up a little set of organizers put in your little gift and then that way that's something they can also use in the classroom. Something else you could do for your teachers on a budget would be to get a few of these magnetic tins. They come in packs of two at Dollar Tree. You could get two packs and fill them up with things for your teacher like push pins, paper clips, they have binder clips and all kinds of daily necessities. You could even put some rubber bands in them, stack them up with a really cute bow. Dollar Tree also carries a lot of markers and highlighters. Those are perfect to add to a teacher's gift. And if you can find them, little things like caddies like this, you can put a few things from the Dollar Tree in a caddy and then that will be used regularly and it's part of your gift. Dollar Tree also has a lot of pins to choose from. These are also great to add to your little caddies, different little gifts you might put together for teachers. They also have this one that's a set of 12 black ballpoint pins. Pins. And speaking of pens, something I've done for teachers in my life is get a pack of pens, something like this, and then go ahead and pick up a set of flowers. They don't have to be Christmas, just some flowers that you think are nice. And then grab some of this floral tape. You just connect the flowers to the pens using the floral tape, and then you can get one of their little pen buckets, put them in there, and then no one's going to walk away with your teacher's pens. Don't forget the Dollar Tree has lots of different glass jars for gifting. I think things like this are really nice when they are filled up with maybe school supplies, paper clips, different little things that teachers are gonna use daily for their desk. Something I've done personally for male teachers is pick up a pair of novelty socks, maybe in a hobby, maybe they're really into coffee or they teach music or science, something that you know about them. Wrap up a little gift card. It could even be for a pizza or lunch and then give them their socks as part of their gift and I'm sure they'll appreciate it. If your Dollar Tree doesn't have a great selection, Office supply stores like Staples actually have quite a few really fun socks to choose from. Since we're here, we're gonna look at a few more options for teachers that are totally affordable. I know that teachers at our schools use Expo markers, erasers, anything for the whiteboard daily. They come in different little packages at different price points. They also have some really nice pencil sharpeners from the higher end, to the more traditional, all at different price points from $20 to $10. And if you're just looking for a little something to say we appreciate you, you can't go wrong with post-it notes. Something like this with a little tag that says just a note to wish you happy holidays is perfect and affordable. They also have lots of scissors to choose from. 
And if you're going the classroom gift route, you may want to consider a really nice paper cutter or hole punch. Just communicate with your teacher ahead of time, see what maybe they need for their classroom, and head to your local office supply store. They have lots of options. It's not a place you normally think of shopping for holiday gifts, but I'm telling you, they've got all kinds of options for the teachers in your life. The other great thing about office supply stores is you're not gonna run into the crowds that you normally would out holiday shopping. I think it's a great place to take the kids and have them look around. They have plenty of options from $5 to $10. And there's probably things that they'll spot that they know their teacher needs or would use in the classroom. With the holiday season comes cold and flu season and not all teachers will celebrate the holidays. So you may wanna consider something like some Clorox wipes, some hand sanitizer, and a little note that says wishing you wellness in the new year. I've also never met a teacher who didn't fully endorse good hand washing. I think great little gifts for teachers are really nice hand soaps. They don't have to be fancy and from Bath and Body Works. You can find them anywhere from places like Home Goods to Ross, and they're always going to run under $5. Now, I would say the holidays are going to be over before we know it, so stay away from holiday scents. Stick with something basic, maybe some lemon or lavender. Now over to Walmart for some more ideas. So Walmart has some really good options as well. They have a jam-free stapler. That's 21. And then a few other options that are right around 10 to $15. Could definitely put together a gift on a budget at Walmart. They have bags of rubber bands for just 67 cents. A really nice little pen caddy organizer 353 up here they've got westcott scissors and they're $1.88 a piece or two for $3.97 if you can't find the ones at dollar tree they also have some nice letter openers some keychains and lots of desk goodies so this whole set is just $4.88 really pretty gold marble clips and pins and i know that the teachers that i have given these to have loved them it's a pack of magnetic circles they use these all the time in the classroom to keep notices and papers up on memo boards and their whiteboards you can get them a pack for 523 for 488 they have a really cool assorted clips and pins set lots of bright colors and i just spotted this this is a pen pal, little magnetic strips to keep your pen where you want them. And that's just $2.88. And for $3.72, they have a really great set of different clips, rubber bands, paper clips. This is a great little gift. It looks like it costs a whole lot more than $3.72. They also have plenty of labelers in different sizes and prices. These little containers are perfect for a teacher's emergency kit if you're gonna put one together and they're just a dollar. Something else that is really affordable and always appreciated and used by teachers are these badge reels. So these can be connected to lanyards or you can buy them on the lanyards already. They have sets down here and lots of different prints. They can put their room keys on these, their badge, and I really do like some of these patterns. Now this one is just the lanyard, so you could match it with one of these badge reels. So for us, the rainy season is right around the corner. It's always right around February. You may want to consider getting your teacher a plain black or maybe school colored umbrella. That's definitely going to get used in the months ahead. So I hope you enjoyed coming along shopping with me and that I gave you a few ideas to work with. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you back very soon.